Hello everyone. Today I'm going to walk you through the process of making this beautiful Buddha painting. I made a sketch on a surface which I primed with my homemade gesso paste. Then I took Fevicol MR and ceramic powder, mixed it well, put it in a cone and then I started drawing the outlines. So I'm doing this once over here and then we shall be doing it many times. Many layers are to be done. The higher the surface, the more the layers. So here I'm doing it once over. When it is done, it looks like this. Now I'm doing the second layer on the outlines that I previously made like the facial features, lotus flowers, ears and the hair. Then I started filling up and spread, spreading it whenever it is needed. Keep going and remember the places you want to look higher, just give them a go over. Now you can see some cracks appearing. We have to fill these cracks with the same paste. Give enough time for one layer to dry. And then again go over the places you want higher. Now making the hair, I really wanted these hair to stand out more so these need a little more work so I'm going spiral 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 in these areas look at how beautiful it has turned out to be all the high places are going to get highlighted Teasing the hair with a pointed tool so that they don't lose their dimension and here we are done with this. Start colouring darkest tone underneath and then highlighting so that it has some dimension. I colored the face also but then I decided to make it even more 3D so I took ceramic powder, Fevicol MR and mixed it into a very 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 thick paste so that I can make the face with this make the face or any 3d parts with uh, MC also but I decided to do it with Fevicol MR and ceramic powder 
in a very thick paste. I really love working with knives. It gives me a lot of freedom, you know, and a lot of movement. You can see how uneven it, it is now. So use water and your hands to even it out. Use both your hands on both the sides so that it it is equal. The proportions are equal. Try putting small parts on on the facial features. Adding small parts will help you balance the face properly. making the eyes, using water and evening them out. I let it dry for 24 hours and then some cracks appeared as they will appear so we can always fill them up with the thick paste of Fevicol MR and ceramic powder. At this stage, see if any flaws are there and then correct them and start colouring. Shading the face. It feels like actually applying makeup to the face. It's very, very, very interesting process. So you can do it in a fun way. Use your hands, use, use your fingers, use your brushes, anything will do. Just use your imagination and you're ready with the results. Thank you for watching but I'll be very happy if you make it and then share your work with me. Thank you. See you next time. Happy creating.